On the same day, the House of Representatives vote to impeach President Donald Trump. Authorities arrest three people from our area in connection with the Capitol oh, riot. We One week ago, chaos broke out in Washington, and since then, federal officials have worked to track down everyone involved. And so far, we know three of them are from Hampton Roads. First, Robert Packer from Newport News. You may have seen his picture floating around social media. Authorities say he wore an anti-Semitic sweatshirt during the riots. The other two locals facing charges are Cindy Fitchett and Douglas Sweet. They are from Matthews County. And tonight we are learning more about those suspects. We start with Packer and Allie Weatherton has the details. The U.S. Marshal's Office, based in Norfolk, arrested Robert Packer early this morning in Newport News. Then just a few hours later, a federal judge said he could be released as long as he signed bond paperwork. His photo taken at the U.S. Capitol grabbed international attention. Investigators say Packer was the man who wore a sweatshirt with the words Camp Auschwitz on it. Today, FBI Norfolk Joint Terrorism Task Force arrested Packer in Newport News. He's charged with knowingly entering or remaining in any restricted building or grounds without lawful authority, as well as violent entry and disorderly conduct on Capitol grounds. Through a virtual hearing, a federal judge said Packer can be released from jail as long as he signed bond paperwork. He does not have to pay bail. The judge went on to say Packer has to do two things, stay out of D.C. and attend his next virtual court appearance. Packer said he would hire his own attorney. His next court date is January 19th. We went to his neighborhood today in Newport News. Neighbors said they collectively agreed to not talk to the media. In Norfolk, Ali Weatherton, 13 News Now. Now to the other two suspects from our area. Both Fitchett and Sweet are both from Matthews County. The FBI says Cindy Fitchett turned herself in yesterday and jail records show she was in jail earlier this afternoon. We don't have a mugshot for Douglas Sweet, but records show he was not held in jail. Right now we don't know what charges they face.